my channel. So, quick disclaimer before I even jump into this video, I want to say if you hear any noise in the background, I have my fan on, it's hot, these studio lights are on me, and your girl wanted to be cute with this little hat. So, let's just go with the flow, alright? Okay, okay. <laughs> Most of you guys may know that I am a college student, so you really don't need that many school supplies. Most people use their laptops, iPads, stuff like that. And honestly, most of your money goes on the books and all that jazz that you need, depending on the class you're taking and all that stuff. So I was just super basic this year. I am very old school, so I have my notebooks, stuff like that. Um, I love to write, so I have notebooks, but I do use my iPad and stuff like that when it comes to um, getting books because it's cheaper when you rent them online. Quick little tip. So I'm going to share some of the steals that I got and hopefully you guys can run out to your local store and get them as well. So let's jump in to this video now. <laughs> so I got this planner. The one thing I didn't get from Staples was this planner. I got this from Marshalls actually. They're so essential when it comes to planning out all of your your tests, your projects coming up. Especially in college, your professor will give you a syllabus so you know in advance what is due and it really helps when you want to just stay focused and make sure you're getting good grades in class because you are prepared and organized. So I got this bad boy for $6. They're definitely cheaper than if you get them at any um, office supply store. I would usually pay like $15 to $20 for a nice planner. So I totally recommend going to a department store like Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Ross, anything near you and see if they have planners or just really cute journals you can use. Alright, so another item I got are these big pens which were actually a splurge, they're not necessary. I got the colorful pack this year because it comes with black, blue, red, and green, pink, purple, and blue which would be perfect when it comes to highlighting certain things in my notes. Another tip I want to add is hold on to your previous pens and stuff like that. So. Definitely save them and reuse them every semester until you can't use them anymore, okay? Alrighty you guys, so the huge bargain of this haul would have to be my notebooks. These are wide ruled one subject notebooks from Staples. What I like to do is get a different color for every single class and the first five notebooks were 10 cents, you guys. 50 cents for five notebooks. And I added a extra one because I might be doing six classes this semester. So the extra one I believe was 25 cents. So definitely go check staples because these are a huge steal. Another thing I purchased were these paper folders. Not gonna lie, I'm not a fan of paper folders because they can get messy when it rains or anything like that. But I do like to keep things organized. So I got a color that matched every notebook that will represent every one of my classes. And I'll just keep my syllabus and like important paperwork that has to do with that certain class. So I figured, you know, why not get it? They were 10 cents, y'all. 10 cents for the first five. And the additional, I think, was 25 cents. And it does, you know, a good job, honestly. It has two pockets, the little prongs in the middle if you want to put paper in between it so definitely check it out 10 cents you know can't lose so like I said before you guys definitely hold on to the supplies that you didn't use in your previous semester I got these last year and look how much I have left these are mechanical pencils they're colorful they last forever because you can reuse them um, and I just love them I have so much left so there were no need for me to um, <laughs> repurchase pencils this year Another thing I purchased, you guys, is filler paper. Like I said, I'm old school, I love to write things down. And if you need a binder for class, you gotta have some filler paper. This was 85 cents each, and yeah, definitely a good deal as well. This is also another splurge. It's a folder, and you guys are probably like, okay, you got a lot of folders. But I plan to keep those paper folders at home and take this one with me throughout the week. It says life is pretty good on the front. Super colorful. I love bright colors to just keep me in a good mood and this quote is beautiful. But what I love about this is that it has all these different compartments, if you guys can see this. All these different compartments. So it literally can hold paper um, for all my different classes. So throughout the week I can just pile everything up 
and then on the weekend I can organize them in my different folders so that's another tip for you guys and this was $3.99 which honestly I didn't think was bad at all because it's so cute and it will resist water or anything like that and it's just it's cute I said that right yeah <laughs> And two things that I also think are really essential, especially for a college student, would have to be a portable charger. You guys, I found this at Marshall's and I fell in love! <laughs> it's a pom-pom, so you add this to your bag, your purse, backpack, whatever. But it's a flamingo, super cute, but get this y'all, it's a charger! It's a portable charger, which is so awesome, it has all these different options so it's perfect for my iPhone and last but not least gotta have some hand sanitizer lotion is cool too but I love hand sanitizer this is from Bath and Body Works with my cute little um, holder it has all these rhinestones on it so yeah you guys I never intend for these hauls to be long but they end up being long because I just like talking to y'all <laughs> and it's been a minute since I've been talking to you guys but Feel free to let me know what are your essential tools, products, all that jazz for school in the comment section below. Remember to subscribe and I'll see y'all in my next video. Love you. Bye.